Now this is a shot composition. What's up everyone? This is I'll Destroyer 229 and welcome back to Let's Play Persona 5. Last time, we finished all of the preparations that we were going to have before venturing into Kaneshiro's palace. We've gotten quite a bit further within our various confidants, but that deadline is starting to loom quite a bit closer. Plus, we're out of money. We can kind of use more money. In this episode, we are going to infiltrate the palace. Now that we've done all of our different persona fusions within the velvet room, we can enter the palace proper. Unfortunately, we can't really enter through the front door now, can we? Hey, don't say that, Queen. You saved us back there. So obviously we can't go through the front door, so we need to find a different way of entering the palace. Now if we look around for a little bit, there's not really too many places that we can go to. But there are these little like piggy statues. Crap, that means it must move. No. The placard kind of looks suspicious. Whoa! Looks like my intuition was right. We're already adequately prepared. Let's go. we can do. Now we're in. Now, normally I think I would be trying to do a history lesson, but we're probably going to be interrupted quite a lot in these opening sequences, especially with new shadows to fight, fight, or face off against. Either or. So, we'll hold off on the history lesson for a little bit. We'll get to it at some point during the palace exploration. Just not immediately. Come on, man. Fortunately, we have a dead end right here. So, I have something. the shutters will open up at some point, just to serve as a shortcut. Uh, but they are not open at the moment, so we're kind of SOL in that regard. Something I could hide. Fortunately, there are these guards out now. Hold a moment. Gotta make sure that we don't get in over our heads. That shouldn't be too big of a Show deal. Show me a true form. 
All right, so now we fight against, hey, Nekomatas. Oh, electricity is what we are going to want to go up against. And yeah, you kind of heard that Makoto was the one to say that. So yeah, she kind of takes over for like analysis is analysis, whatever. She's the one that analyzes enemies now. Uh, let's see. There were a few personas that I wanted to raise. There were Suzaku and Matador. Uh, let's raise up Suzaku so that way it can get Mafuda. Cool, and then we can do this. Cool, Joker. And since we don't really need to do anything with you, let's go. We can finish them off. Hmm. Not a problem. Hey, I leveled up. Level up. So close to a level up. Maybe I should have waited to do some Persona Fusions. Oh, well, okay. whatever. Not that big of a deal. That's all it takes for me. Um, I don't see any other treasures in the immediate vicinity. But there is you. And also some walking ETMs. Show me your true form. And high pixies as well. Okay, guns or nuclear? Well, you can use guns. Damn it. Go ahead and do that, and then switch on over to Panther. Thank you kindly. Now kill them all. Perfect. I mean, at some point we are going to have to show off Queen's finisher, but unfortunately, without a baton pass, that's okay. going to be a little bit difficult. A decisive victory. Oh well. Focus. So all we can do is keep on moving around. Now we can actually head on over this way back here. Uh, unfortunately, we can't enter through this way. Joker. I mean, there's still a point in just checking back here because there are a few treasures to be had back here. Also, some oddly realistic people here. Kind of interesting. But anyway, big reason why we want to go back here is because there's a treasure chest. With an Elysian robe. So, a nice piece of female equipment. Uh, let's see, we'll go ahead and... Ooh, that is really good. Go ahead and give that to the panther, and I'm regretting this army vest now. Uh, is there anyone else who could use it? Yes, actually. Okay, so that's not entirely, it's not entirely useless and a waste of money. I have something. Good. I'm starting to feel a little silly about that. But anyway, now that we got that, we can get back to what we are supposed to be doing. Something. That's infiltrating the palace. Okay, so... going down there, then that's the perfect reason for us to head yeah, over there. But, we're gonna have to find some way of opening it first. Show me first, that means board. killing you. Ooh, Aromas! We're finding all sorts of personas that we've already had. Oh well, whatever. Uh, let's go ahead and switch on over to where's Matador? There's Matador. You're mine. You're all knocked down. 
go ahead and knock them down and finish them. In retrospect, I probably should try negotiations, but I find that works best if there's only one enemy. Okay. Because otherwise, that's wasted money and experience. Didn't even break a sweat. Um. Oh, excellent. It's a treasure chest. Go ahead and get on over here. Not exactly a good way, but there we go. That'll do. And angels. Ooh. Well, zealous messengers, but. You know, I think I'm starting to crawl out of just calling them by these names and holding off on what they're actually called. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead. I would rather just only have to deal with one of them to, um, to negotiate with. Uh, let's switch to Suzaku. Oh, shoot. Well, damn. I was not expecting that. Try nuclear. Okay, that worked decent, I guess. Resist electricity. Uh, how about fire? Well, I did not want you to kill all of them, Panther. I guess I they're only weak to darkness. And hey, Skull leveled up. I mean, yeah, I... I knew they were weak to darkness, but I figured they'd be weak to guns because I wanted to just try to get to one of them being there. Oh, whatever. There's a treasure chest over here, so let's go ahead and open that up. With a Balm of Life. Ooh, that's really good. Uh, there are a few other places for us to explore. We have some broken down ATM people. And a Lifestone. Plus, there's this little cubicle area with a door. I can feel it. A door that I have something. It seems a bit out of place. I can feel it. Like, I mean, it has some nice treasures here, but Somewhere. it just kind of seems a bit odd. I mean, you'd kind of expect that to be like a safe room or whatnot, but no. In fact, I actually think. If I'm remembering right, I don't think there are that many safe rooms Indeed. in this palace. So, yeah, that's actually something that's going to be a bit troublesome. Uh, I don't see anything over that way. More ATMs. Uh, ooh. Wait. Well, I was hoping I could get to the hide position, but this will work too. Uh, So yeah, the dog versions of shadows have a lot further range on perceptions. Show me your true form. But thankfully, you can't just walk up from behind them. They're also usually some sort of canine creature, like this one, the twin-headed guardian. Uh, what exactly are you weak to? I want to say you're weak to nuclear. You resist nuclear. Well, damn it. Okay, this is starting to go to hell real fast. Uh, how? You know, Sarunda. Ah! Uh -huh. All right, he's next. Okay, so nuclear is out. Um, let's try. Uh, I should probably stick with Suzaku. Uh, darkness? Oh, darkness is decent. Ooh! You got it, Panther! So 
so that's Panther. Panther's follow-up attack. And that is our option if we want to get some extra items. But we need money, damn it. Huh, we didn't actually get the option to demand more for that one. Maybe because we would've got the guarantee item or something. I'm not sure. Not that I'm complaining, though. I wouldn't have gone after another, like, okay. Well, demand anyway. Uh, there was another shadow, though, so I'm going to head on over this way to let it respawn. And then... We can get up here. Me a true form. And face off against an Oni. Uh, I don't think Onis actually have any weaknesses, now that I think about it, which is a little bit problematic. Go ahead and use Garunda. Uh, Queen. Go with nuclear. Just deal damage. Uh, go ahead and use Zio. And Agi. Uh-oh. Okay, well that still worked. Uh, ooh, why don't we try? Hey, hey! Okay, um, I'm not sure I can really... PSI would be a good follow-up, but... I suppose I can just go with this as well. Oh, it's still alive. Not anymore, it ain't. <laughs> Unfortunately, some of the enemies aren't exactly that great in trying to recruit. Onis in particular are pretty bad because they resist physical, which means it's hard to get a regular crit off them if you're not using Mona. All right. And then there's also the fact that they don't have any weaknesses, which is also a problem. Now, there is this door over here, but... Um... Alright, so we need to come back here later then. Um, uh, hey! Nah, nah, nah. Oh, there's a guard dog there too. Uh, well, let's get on over here. Um. Okay. Sure, we'll go against the dog. Of course, it's weak to ice. All enemies defeated. Just what I'd expect from you, Joker. Well, damn it. Mm, nice work, team. Oh well. At least Genbu leveled up. All right. And it learned Mabu Fu. Resist, forget. Eh, not the best skill. Okay. Uh, I'm going to head on over this way and then switch off of Genbu because it's not that great of a persona. Uh, we'll be right here. Try to get where he is and ambush him. Show me your true form. All right. Uh, taking a look at my SP, I think I'm being a little bit too reckless with my SP usage. I think I would normally would have gotten that uh, SP recovery accessory by this point. Unfortunately, I spent too much money trying to get other pieces of equipment. Yeah. And, oh. Oh, poor guy. So yeah, unfortunately, I may be a, a little bit out of luck on this one. But hey, we've got a shortcut now. I mean, I'm just gonna have to live with that! No, 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 no! Where, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Get back here! We have ourselves a new, well, rare enemy. The Queen's Necklace. Uh, 
Oh, what are you weak to? 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 I'm not done. Uh, light? You're mine. Resist light. That's not good. Uh, we'll try nuclear. Not nuclear. Um, physical? Resist physical. Fire! This is fire. Okay. Uh, darkness. Damn it. Have I not tried? Gun, ice, electricity, wind, and psychokinesis. Weak to guns! Perfect! And now we get the Queen's Necklace. Ooh. Yeah, always hard to remember what exactly each of these, like, rare enemies are, well, susceptible to. At the very least, we got that, so in case... In case you run into another one, it should be very easy to take okay. down. Alright, but now we have to find where exactly we need to go to from here. So that isn't any place that we can go to. I have something. However, we can climb up this. And crawl through the ventilation shaft. And hello. You got it. Going for the ambush. I'll reveal the true form. Ooh, four Arabuses. Well, thankfully, I have a Matador. They're all knocked down. And then we can just do this. Not a problem. Hey, sweet! Everyone else leveled up, too. And... <laughs> nice! What Fox skill. got Mabufu. And that was it. Okay. Yeah, who knows if there's another sort of monitoring room it. that has, well, that's in control of that. Kind of with Queen on that um. one. And thankfully, with this newfound key card, Anytime we see uh, that sort of device, we can use it to open doors. So it'll be very nice to get through to different places that we can, well, that we didn't have access to before. And also the enemies respawn too. Form. 
Okay. Yeah, I'm definitely being way too reckless with my SP usage at this rate. I mean, thankfully, this is the very reason why I have so many SP recovery items. I'm not gonna last too much longer if I keep using it like this. Ugh. Oh. Gotta be careful. What sucks is that there are enemies that just aren't really susceptible to physical attacks. Don't know we're here, huh? So that doesn't bode well for us either. Show me a true form. Okay. Well, that sucked. That enemy was pretty good. Yeah, they took down Queen. <sighs> okay. Well, let's go ahead and switch her out for. Mona. Perhaps his skill will make things a little bit easier. <sighs> Although, I don't exactly like the fact that I keep having to use up my SP. Oh well, let's go ahead and just open up the door here. Oh. And there we go. Now I can enter. We can get on the elevator from here. Well, Perfect. All right, so let's go ahead and jump down here. How convenient. There's actually a little hole right here for ventilation. That's right on top of the elevator. Uh, well, that's a dead end. All right. Hmm. You got it. This leads to. Huh. Interesting. We're above here. Where is here though? So now we're at least in the basement portion. We can head on out this way. It's a safe room. Where there's a safe room. Perfect. Oh, a new safe room. All right, our first safe room, the whole freaking palace. break. I really should have saved up my money and just immediately bought that accessory. I am really regretting not doing that. Oh, well, whatever. What's done is done. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and use some of these adhesive bandages on her, on Queen. 
thankfully, I do have all of the sodas. It's the very reason why I got them to begin with. And then let's check in on everyone. Well. Hmm. What, you mean like that Oni? Ah, <sighs> well, go. whatever. We're still doing relatively alright. I think just to be on the safe side, I am going to save. I'll just add this. And we are starting to run a little bit low okay. on time. Uh, I'll just see what's around the immediate vicinity. And then I can see whether or not that we will Focus. call it a day. There doesn't seem to be too much, though. Except some more treasure! Uh, okay. Well, there doesn't seem to be much else that wouldn't just lead to something even bigger. So I think for the time being, we are going to go ahead and call it a day here. So, next time on Let's Play Persona 5. We have reached the basement portion of Kaneshiro's Bank. We could be looking a little bit better, but overall we're still doing all right. Uh, this is why I have so many different supplies as well. I kind of need to be a little bit more careful about these sodas, otherwise I'm going to run out of them. But we're going to continue pressing onward and then getting through, well, more of Kaneshiro's bank. Uh, probably next time we'll begin the history lesson as well. I did want to try to get a little bit into the palace before starting that. And the palace is relatively big, although I only am expecting to do just one history lesson over the course of this palace. So hopefully we'll be able to get through that next time. Until then everyone, take care.